Ladies and gentlemen, today I found a very special coach to show you. Behind me is a Newell coach that is handicap accessible. Today I'm hanging out with Jerry Davis. How you doing today, sir? Very good, very good. beautiful day. It really is. So beautiful coach you have here, Thank but you. this coach has some amazing features on it that really impressed me and, and really helped uh, some folks live the RV lifestyle that normally couldn't. So you want to tell us a little bit about this coach? Absolutely. This is a 2005. Just looks like a normal Newell. A lot of people don't even realize that it does have a wheelchair lift on it and it is uh, accessible for a person with a disability. So basically, the one, it works with the same door. Um, so the door opens, step comes out like it does on most all the newels. This is a this step is actually made by the Braun Ability Corporation in Winnemac, Indiana. Ralph Braun was a former owner of a newel and partnered with Newell many, many years ago to help them design a very, very robust step for their product. Yes, sir. And they are still using it today. In addition, this with, to this Braun step, we have a Braun lift that uh, once you it's remote controlled. That goes in automatically. The wheelchair lift comes out. And what year is this, Coach? This is 2005. 2005, and was this new, or uh, when was this converted? No, this this was an original build. Originally built this way. Yeah. So, and we have some really special guests on the show today. This is Carissa, Jerry's daughter, and Luann. How are you doing today? We're good. Well, thanks for showing this off. This is really incredible to see. That was really pretty effortless. Yeah, it's, uh, it's very eight, nice. It's much easier than carrying them. Yeah. 850 pound capacity. Lift. Wow. Yeah. Heavy, heavy duty. And all with a press of a button there. wheelchair lift actually has part of the serial the model number on it I believe is is RWB which stands for Ralph William Braun so that was part of the, the model number as because Ralph had this specially designed for the for the new coach and uh, Ralph was quite a pioneer in the in the disability industry and yeah I've, a lot of wrinkles I, I've heard Very a lot guy. yeah I've heard a lot of really cool stuff about Ralph Braun uh, you want to give us a share with us a quick kind of history on Ralph? Well, Ralph, uh, I don't know the exact year he was born, but in the 40s, um, at the age of six, his parents saw that he wasn't, he was acting, he, he walked and acted different than some of the other kids. And I took him to the hospital in, at Riley Hospital in Indianapolis and was determined that he had muscular dystrophy. And at that time, his parents were told that he probably wouldn't live to be a teenager. Um, however, he, he went on, uh, overcame a lot of struggles and uh, ended up, he did pass away. Oh, well, he, he, he invented the first scooter, the first wheelchair lift, the first hand control, driving controls for the most part. And uh, just every time there was a necessity for himself, he developed it more or less. And then people heard about what he was doing and come in and what we want you to do this for him. For them, um, he, unfortunately, he did pass away in 2013 at the age of 72. And at that time, he had, uh, I believe, 700 employees on 400 continents. So, for a gentleman who was not supposed to live to be past teenager, he accomplished for a lot. And really, really a, a good, a good wholesome man. And uh, we got to know him very well the last four or five years of his life. And uh, he's just a special guy. We really miss him. Yeah, what an incredible story and really, really awesome to see his work here on display. Now, there's some other cool stuff going on in this uh, coach as well that you were telling me about. Uh, you mind showing uh, me sure. and the folks on YouTube? Um, I've been working on it as Luann and I get struggling to get a little older. Chris, yeah. Chris is 43 years old, has been disabled since she was 15. Um, so as we get older and uh, not quite as as uh, healthy as we were it's more of a struggle to get her transferred out of her chair into into her bed and what have you so i've uh, just recently uh taken under a task to build a lift that will uh, help chris get out of her chair and into bed so come on in yeah uh, thank you yeah so uh, this is a little bit crude. It's it's my first concept. Um, this is basically a, what what's 
called the Hoyer lift. It uh, it's basically <laughs> like just a little hydraulic lift, but it's normally on a set of wheels uh, with a, a base on it. But I, I saw that I didn't. We don't really have room for that in here, so I there's room underneath the slide here. So I've actually taken some drawer slides. I kind of got the idea from the slides that are in the basement of all of our new coaches. Yes, sir. So slide out. And uh, these are spare parts that uh, our company, we install, sell and, and service and install stair lifts. So these are some leftover rails from two different companies. Um, so I put them, I've, I've got a design where this will slide out. This lifts out and can be stowed. You can let it all the way down to fold it, make it a little more compact. And then it will lift out and can be stowed. Just yeah. Stowed, actually will be carried in our van. And then this this panel here will come out in these slides. It can be stowed as well. These will go back underneath. And then there's panels that snap on there, cover that up to make it look and give you enough room. When this when the slides are in, it's a little compact walking through here. So then these are a little bit big for for stowing I'd, I'd like to come up with something uh, that i can stow in here stand upright or some type of case or something but yeah anyway it's definitely made a dramatic issue a change for us being able to get chris out of her chair and into bed and vice versa so that is really, really on our backs really <laughs> awesome safer for chris too yep that's so it, it's important. still this is the concept model but um i hope to fine tune it a little more and uh, just make it uh, a little neater a little more compact possibly very cool anyway we're we're doing what we can well jerry and luann i can't thank you enough for taking the time to show me and the folks out on youtube this amazing newell coach it's really awesome to see what braun mobility and newell coach have teamed up to do to make it possible for those less fortunate to be able to travel by rv i just have so much respect for folks like you out there that are taking care of the less fortunate and i know how tough it can be so uh, I have a ton of respect for you guys and just can't thank you enough for just being awesome people and greatly appreciate you guys. So I also greatly appreciate all of you out there on YouTube, subscribing to the channel and liking these videos. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Thanks.